Top. I don't know who's doing this stupid retarded domination game on this internet and in, in Canada and America, but whoever it is, whoever they are, they are literally the most revolting, degenerate, freak show clowns you could ever imagine. You know? Like they sit there and it's like everything on this world is, is basically boils down to a, to a psychological warfare, spiritual warfare or psych spiritual being the mind or the soul. No, warfare. So the mind, psychological, warfare, warfare. There you go. Psychological warfare to destroy your mind slash soul. That seems to be the whole point of everything on this word, world. It all boils down to the same thing. Once you start learning it and you see it, it's like, holy crap. Every single thing these people are doing is about trying to kill your soul. They, try, they spend their lives trying to enslave you, trying to enslave you to evil, try to whore you to revolting demonic retarded creeps on this planet to defile your flesh and, and, and stain your soul forever. So you've experienced, so you've like basically like moaned like a whore for demonic retarded filth. And then so they try to stain your filth, strain, stain your flesh with, by, by, by experiencing pleasure and happiness with filth. No, spread it, sharing goodness with evil. No, and that's basically what they do. They try to defile and destroy your flesh unbelievably. Now, and then they sit there and they go to work on your soul, which is basically like trying and trying and trying to get you to knowingly and willingly accept evil and, and thus reject good and fall forever and become foul, putrid garbage like all of them. No, when you go on this YouTube, I don't know if it's YouTube employees doing it or if it's, if it's the channel owners doing it, but whenever you speak truth, logic, and common sense about morality, or the design of the ritualistic crimes that, that seem to be spearheaded by, by the Caucasian race, when you speak the truth about that, they will just instantly like try to dominate you and be like, boom, delete and destroy it. Waste your time. Yeah? So that you're so that they feel in control. It's a, it doesn't they're not in control. They're just trying to brainwash you and make you feel and get angry and irritated that they're wasting your time and destroying everything you do. You know, it's like what the, they want you to spend your entire life making them and their idiotic garbage the center of attention in your life. They want you to fill your soul, your mind, with evils, worthless, nonsensical, idiotic garbage. You know, so it's like you, you see all these rabbis or these Christians or whoever spreading tons and tons and tons of idiotic garbage about their, their belief systems, which can easily be, be disproven with, the, with the, the slightest understanding of good and bad and right and wrong. You can literally shoot down the religions of earth with just slight understanding of good and bad and right and wrong. Just poof, <laughs> destroyed. And, and, and even when you prove, when you try to sit, tell people and prove it, they just basically delete it, ban it, whatever. No, we don't, we don't want, we don't want to embrace and, and, and entertain what you do. You know, go away, take that crap, go away. You know, if you're not going to let us be the center of attention, then go away. And that's what these, these people on the internet are doing. They're sitting there peddling filth, stupidity, immorality, and garbage so that you are accepting evil and their filth in your mind and soul and basically rejecting good and becoming worse and worse and worse. That's all they're doing. Yeah. You, you spread truth, honesty, truth and honesty, logic, common sense, and stuff like that. And uh, they just, just try to destroy it and defile it. Like, whatever. No. Yeah. These people are trying to corrupt and ruin as many souls as they possibly can. They are literally trying to dominate the souls of everyone on earth. They really are. Yeah. They're trying to permanently murder your soul so that if your soul is eternal, you live in misery for the rest of eternity. That's literally what they're trying to do. And, and they try to present it like, oh, no, it's not, not, not a joke or anything. It's just a joke. Yeah, it doesn't mean anything. You're wrong. Forget about it. Yeah. But that's all they do. You spread the truth about their domination game and how the world, everything on earth seems to be a domination game of trying to, it's, it's like the Matrix, born into bondage. They try to, they, they, they try, right away, start it as a child. They start mind controlling you, brainwashing you, conditioning you through verbal, psychological abuse and manipulation different forms of abuse, not necessarily like physical pain and suffering, but there's, there's other, there could be pleasure and happiness, which are forms of abuse as well, like, like sexual immorality and perversion. All that kind of stuff is different forms of abuse. 
So basically, they start at a young age, basically guiding you into filth and immorality. The more you accept it, the more you're rejecting good, and the more you're inviting evil. And it just gets worse and worse and worse until finally you can somehow rid yourself of evil and start embracing good and, and truth. Yeah, but these people on this internet, like I said, I don't know if it's Facebook themselves, Elon Musk, Twitter, yeah, or uh, Instagram, or YouTube. I don't know if it's actually the real YouTube and stuff like that, or if it's their employees doing it, or the channel owners and stuff like that. But like I said, as soon as you start spreading truth and you're like, you know what? I don't want your garbage. You're peddling filth. You're peddling lies. You're peddling garbage. Yeah. As soon as you do that, they're like, piss off. Delete it. Go away. You know? Because basically what happens, symbolically, I mean, the whole story has been turned around. All these people who are trying to dominate and control with, with garbage, they have been permanently plastered to the dead bottom of reality because of what the creator has done through me to humanity and all evil in existence. So even if they're trying to corrupt and ruin people, those people might fall and become corrupted, but they'll never be inferior to the scum, people, this, these scumbags on this internet and on this world who are corrupting and ruining people. Those, those people intentionally trying to corrupt and ruin people, those are permanently the sludge of all existence, the bottom of the barrel of filth for all eternity. You cannot become worse than them. Because what they've done and what they've been doing is so foul that they're permanently, infinitely worse every second of all eternity. But they still sit there and try anyway. You know, because basically what happens is when evil, when pure evil are peddling you filth and stupidity and lies, when pure evil are peddling you filth, stupidity and lies, and you accept it in your life, you're rejecting good and you start falling. All right? If you knowingly and willingly do that enough, you will basically become pure evil yourself. And that means that you are rejecting the creator, everything good in reality, everything decent, good and honest and whatever. You're rejecting it all and basically bending a knee to all evil in existence and like the devil and stuff like that. Yeah? So when these people are peddling idiotic nonsense in their videos, immorality and filth and stuff like that, they're trying to make you fall and become a worse person so that you are as if rejecting good and bending a knee to them and letting them be the center of attention in your life. They will do anything they can to try to get you to fuck it. These, these influencers, politicians, so, you know, different types of celebrities and stuff like that, authors, whatever. They'll do whatever they can to peddle you filth, cryptic, disgusting filth. They will peddle it to you nonstop in hopes that you accept it into your life and your mind and thus reject good. And so you're bending a knee to them in a, in a symbolic way. No, because they're being an instrument of your destruction. Yeah? They're making you worse and worse and worse. So it's like you're being their bitch. Yeah? And they do it with a smile on their face. That's all they do. They're scumbags. They're absolute scumbags. They don't want to. If you try to create something and share it with the world, they'll trash it. Try to do anything they can to try to trash it just to be assholes and try to hide the truth. And they really are scumbags. They will not stop trying to dominate and control everyone and everything they possibly can. They're the most revolting cracks you could ever imagine. But uh, anyway, there you go.